Here is a check of the nation's weather. This holiday forecast looks like this. Lots of snow, lake effect snow coming across the Great Lakes. We'll see maybe two feet of snow for places around Chicago into Detroit. Look for some delays if you're traveling by air. In front of this, we've got a break in here of some clear skies, which is what we're seeing, but with no clouds, that means very, very cold temperatures. Snow for the higher elevations of the New England area, and by tomorrow, all of this moves our way. So if you can travel today and get off the roads tomorrow by Thanksgiving, you'll be doing pretty good. Take a look at the snow. They're all that white. All right, so Boston, a few showers, 41 degrees, snow showers possible later on in the afternoon, 39 for Hartford. A little sunshine for Newark, Philadelphia, possible snow by late tonight, Pittsburgh as well. Crazy day in weather on this Wednesday. Lots of showers for the West Coast heading into the Rocky Mountains, and there could be some real stormy weather developing with that as it heads into the Central Plains, much like we saw last Sunday night. Then we've got showers, and yes, the white stuff is snow. In fact, take a look at this. We have up to two to three inches of snow possible already right now up in the Poconos and in some areas about a quarter mile visibility people bundled up they've got their umbrellas and it's raining and snowing it's just total chaos out there it looks like it's going to stay that way for the next couple of hours take a look at your forecast here's what it looks like out there for you for the major cities Boston showers little snow possible 46 Hartford cloudy 40 Newark 43 Philly 48 Pittsburgh 41 Baltimore 51 look for the moisture rain and snow combined Here's a check of the nation's weather, and as we put it all in motion for you, you can see what's happening. More moisture coming in off the Pacific Northwest. Another storm that's starting to move now through our region. It means gusty winds. We've seen those temperatures also dropping quite a bit, even some snow showers throughout New York, and heavy showers continuing throughout the day today for quite a few of the cities throughout the CN8 viewing area. They'll move out, but with April showers, we get May flowers. And if you think that April is the wettest month, well, actually, it's July, but we're going to see some showers over the next couple of days on and off. Here's what it looks like for your forecast for today. Boston showers 56, Hartford 50 in showers, Newark 50 in showers as well. Philadelphia partly cloudy, some showers possible this evening. Pittsburgh 45, Baltimore 60. Here's a check of the national forecast. Some scattered showers really from Montana through the Rockies all the way down into the Four Corners area. Not too much to talk about there. Clear skies through the Central Plains, but look at the snow throughout the New England area for the higher elevations, and we are seeing the cold temperatures out there right now. The good news is it's not going to last for long. Just some chilly air for the next 24 hours, and then things start to warm up as we head into the weekend. So for today, look for partly cloudy skies in Boston, but 47 is your high. Bundle up out there. Hartford 48, Newark 52, Philadelphia 53, Pittsburgh 50, and Baltimore 53. Those cooler temperatures because the skies are clear, so we don't have any blanket keeping the warm weather in. Enjoy it today. Tomorrow it's a little bit of a warm up for you. Take a look at the nation's weather in the next 24 hours. You can see how the storm systems move. We're going to have a big one in the central part of the United States and possibly some dangerous tornadoes like we had last Sunday uh, morning. So this has a lot of energy with it. We're watching it closely. High pressure starts to move in. The moisture starts to move out for us up in the New England area, mid-Atlantic as well. So that's good news, but it does look like we'll see some moisture in the next couple of days by what is gaining strength right now in the central plains. Here you go. 42, partly cloudy today in Boston, Hartford, 50, Newark, 50. 55, Philadelphia 58, Pittsburgh 60, Baltimore 60. Some nice temperatures out there for today. Looks like a, a nice Thursday for everyone all the way around. Take a look at the nation's weather, and you can see we have some moisture moving in to the central and southern plains down into the Tennessee Valley. And with that, some unstable air right now that could cause some severe thunderstorms for today. Throughout much of the east coast, though, things look pretty good. We've got a lot of sunshine in the forecast and mild temperatures for today. And it looks like that will be the case again probably tomorrow as well. So take a look. Boston, 38 degrees. Hartford, 48. Newark, 45. Philadelphia, 49. We're creeping up towards 68 by the weekend.